this past week, uh, I had a conversation with a mom at school and she was talking about, oh my gosh, the Fed's going to raise interest rates three quarters of a percent. Rates are going up. And that's such a misnomer because when we say rates, I think everyone thinks that rates are the same. Let's talk a little bit about what that really means for people, for consumers. What does that mean? What happened with mortgage rates from essentially November of last year through now is an anticipation of inflation. Inflation is the enemy of bonds. Mortgages are packaged and sold as bonds, but you know the enemy of mortgage rates is inflation. And just simple math, if your mortgage rate that somebody's buying, if the investor's buying your mortgage as an investment and it's at 3%, but inflation is at 9%, that person is losing 6% until inflation gets under control. And inflation goes up and down. So this is a 30 year bond, mostly institutions buy them, not really, you and I aren't going out to buy a mortgage. That's not what you and I are gonna do as an investment. The average rate of return over time will average 30 years of inflation data. But when inflation's going up and essentially is unchecked, so too must interest rates to get the desired return for the investor. In what we've seen in the last couple months, you know, the worst kept secret in the world is the Fed is aggressively raising interest rates, and that is to combat inflation.